Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for August. I already did one for August, and I'm going to tag it to the end. So we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for Aries? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. What do we have for Aries? We have two cards that have fallen out. This is for at any time in August. What do we have for Aries? Okay. Tent. Temporary situation. So you're in some sort of temporary situ situation, maybe a temporary living situation. Uh, feather. Someone you know is undependable and insecure. 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 Someone you know is dependable and insecure. May have something to do. It's undependable and insecure. Younger man may have something to do with a younger man. Dealings or relationship with a younger man. Lobster. Financial pinch. Financial pinch. You may be in some sort of financial pinch this month. Um, it's temporary. It is temporary by the looks of things. What do we have for Aries? Sun, moon, right? You could have somebody here that is... Uh, after your money in some way, you probably can't trust this person. I think it is a younger man because the younger man is right on over the undependable and insincerity. So you got a younger man that is that you can't trust. Okay, they may be wanting to or trying to help you invest with something that is probably uh, something you shouldn't do. Okay. Um, Interesting. So what do we have for Aries? Missed opportunity. So we have a missed opportunity here. You've missed an opportunity in some way. Mm. New sexual partner. be this younger man. Or there's a younger man that is in the way of this new partner. Something is going on here with this younger man. New sexual partner at the right place at the right time. So maybe you're going to meet somebody at the right place at the right time. Or the time is ahead, okay? There's, that's in the future. It is in the future. So it feels like you're going to get together with somebody in the future. Maybe somebody that you missed an opportunity with. That's what it looks like to me. Um, could be wrong, but we have this younger man that is undependable and insincere that you need to be aware of, okay? You need to be aware of this person's card just fell off. Um, drama queen. So you may be dealing with a drama queen. So what do we have? What do we have for Aries? What do we have for Aries for August? You ready for this? The lovers. Unexpected choice in love. So this is a love connection, right? It is kindred spirits. It's it's getting together. It's sexual. It's sensual. It's compatible. This is love. It's uh, deepening a bond with somebody. Unexpectedly, because that's an unexpected choice. It is. You could, if you are single, you're not looking, whatever, you could find yourself at the right place at the right time. 
connecting with somebody new that you have a strong attraction to because it's a very it is a very sexual energy it is this is at the right place at the right time but we have missed opportunity I wonder if you I feel I mean when there's a missed opportunity maybe you've already you know maybe you've uh, not seen this I don't know we're gonna get one of these. Soul journey. You know, the lover's card can be a reconciliation as well. So I'm not sure if you're reconciling. That's in the future, it's in the future. So there's something that is coming that is gonna bring you some passion. There is passion, there's a connection here. Uh, this lovers can be a, like a soulmate connection. Typically it's something that is meant to be um, soul journey. I'm going to go ahead and read that for you. This is a life lesson. That's what it says. Learn from this experience. From the moment you choose to return to earth in this incarnation, you decided, you decided to be a conscious creator of your life's journey. Your story, as you have written it, is held within the records of the Akashic, or Akashic, however, it doesn't matter how you say it, temples, and can be assessed, viewed, and experienced at any time. Organized like a library, the Akashic temple holds the records of each soul's journey. Energetically, within the astral plane, thoughts, feelings, actions, deeds, past lives, purpose and soul lessons are recorded within this place. I wonder if you have like a past life connection or something here. Acting as a spiritual database, every human process we experience is recorded. Events, births, deaths, marriages, and other life events can be, re be reflected upon at any time. Your individual record is protected by your guardians who ensure that permission is granted and safe access is available at your request. The integrity of the Akashic or Akashic is never compromised as a result. Right now you are experiencing a life lesson. Whatever the outcome, know that this lesson is for a reason, even if you are unaware of it. It is important that you become mindful of your experiences, acknowledging decisions and actions that have led you to this moment. Ask yourself, what is it that I need to learn from this situation? How am I affected by it? What can I do that will help me correct this negative course of action? How can I improve my soul's connection to my higher purpose? What can I do to support humanity? While you may be unable to see a way out of your circumstances right now, this will pass and you will soon be shown the reason for recent events. And that's why we have temporary situation here. You're going to be shown a reason. There's a partner here. The lovers is a partnership that it's unexpected. It is important to recognize the value of your experiences and resolve past issues and patterns from the experience of lessons learned. Co-create a beautiful life with new perspectives. The choice is up to you. Where do you want to go from here? So you have to make a choice. And it is about love. Because lovers is a choice. And it's about love. It's about your partnership. Okay? About your connections. But obviously, you've made some mistakes. We all do. Maybe when you were a younger man. If you're a man watching this... Maybe when you were a younger man, you've made some mistakes. Sometimes, you know, it's time to, you know, grow up. Anyhow, sometimes we have someone you know also that is in, undependable and insincere that you need to be aware of. I'm going to go ahead and set that right here and get these cards. Financial pinch. You may be suffering in some sort of financial situation. It's all part of the plan. You have to make some sort of choice. You you have to make a choice in regards to some sort of partnership that you're in. Mm -hmm. What do we have for Aries? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Six of Wands reversed. 
that's that's no victory, no progress. Losing, losing a battle. It's like you're losing a battle. You've been losing some sort of battle. It's in the past position. Eight of swords reversed. Ah, five of swords reversed. So I feel like you need to walk away from something. The five of swords reversed is I got, if you want happiness, if you want peace, you need to stop uh, trying to control a situation. There's like, I want to control something. I want to win at all costs. Sometimes it's better to walk away than to fight. It's like you've been fighting a losing battle. Okay, the past in the past position is a six of wands reverse that's fighting a losing battle next card eight of swords reverse that's in the present that's removing an obstacle maybe you're trapped in a situation you've chosen to be trapped you can break free your feet aren't tied you can go and i can see that you need to go it's like you're you're it's safe right playing it safe held back by maybe it's a it's a victim mentality these are my circumstances i can't change my circumstances that is mentality okay both the Eight of Swords and the Five of Swords is about your mentality. You know, you may have somebody here that is in their ego. They want to be right. You know, they don't, there's, this is a disgrace. It's embarrassing. I, you know, I got to stay here because I'm embarrassed. You know, we may also have somebody here that has been through some trauma. You know, maybe it's past life trauma or it's trauma, you know, from their past that has made them feel like they aren't good enough. You know, and that's what it looks like to me. Six of Wands reverse, no victory, no progress, things not winning, losing, losing a battle. It's like you're, you're fighting a losing battle when you should just walk away. I mean, that's that those three. That's what those three cards say. You know, you you choose. You can choose to engage in this battle that isn't you aren't winning, or you can choose to walk away. You have, but you're gonna have to master your emotions and step outside of your comfort zone. And I think right now, I don't know if you've been lying to yourself about something with the Eight of Swords reversed. You know, sometimes it's hard to admit defeat, okay? The, the Five of Swords is about admitting defeat. You know, defeat, it is. I mean, I'm gonna show it to you upright, but at the bottom it says defeat. A defeat it came out reversed you see those people walking away you know some t and maybe you've pushed people away it's reversed maybe you've pushed people away because you're protecting yourself you know you've been looking out for number one number we got somebody here that's been looking out for number one and number one only you know maybe it's, it's time for you to stop pushing people away um, and walk away from the people that hurt you you know there's been some sort of betrayal here or something like that Eight of Wands. Eight of Pentacles reversed. We got three eights. Oh, we got three eights. Eight, eight, eight. The time is now. It's time to move on. When you see eight, 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 it's time to move on. Something isn't working out. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Right now, it's in the present position. Right now, something isn't working out. I don't know if 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 you're working and working and working and you're not gaining anything from it, you're not gaining anything. The battery's dead. So everything happens for a reason. Interesting that the battery battery would die just like that. And I know what happened, okay? I know what happened because when I was getting ready to get started, and everything that happens is part of this reading. It's all there's no such thing as coincidence. There really isn't. I uh, I reached underneath and I grabbed my spare battery and I put it up here, and then I. Uh, took the camera, the battery, the old battery that was in the camera from last night, and I put it right here, right next to the other one. And I went and I did something in the kitchen and I came back and I looked at the batteries and I was like, shit, you know, shit. Uh, and then I put, put it back in the battery charger down there and they both came up yellow. So I was like, well, which one is the one? You know, which one is the one? And, and it's interesting. 
because the lovers is which one is the one, which one is the one, you know? That's a choice between two, okay? Uh, it is. So which one is the one? And I just looked at him, you know, I was like, okay, well. Anyway, I checked down below and they both, they both said yellow or so I was like, but I know one of them's charged, but the minute you take it out, the minute you take it out and you put it back in, it automatically goes to yellow. Just if you take it out at all, I know that. Okay, I've done this before. So, uh, I'm like, well, I'm going to put this one in. <laughs> I'm going to put this one in and see what I think this is the one. Obviously, it was the wrong one. Obviously, it was the wrong one because it's dead. It didn't work out. And I see something not working out with the Eight of Pentacles reversed. That happened right as I was talking. Oh, we have Death reversed right next to it. So, that is, that is a disaster. It's a sudden death of some sort or holding on is getting old. This isn't working out and the battery is dead. Interesting, interesting, very interesting. So I had to change it. It was in death is about change. It was like, I had to stop right now. Okay. There was no, other, I could see it blinking up there on my screen. It was like, and it just happened all of a sudden. It was like, all of a sudden I just looked up and it was like, Beep, 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 You know, but it wasn't making the noise, obviously, but I could see it. I could see the red blinking. So, uh, gotta change it, because it's gonna, it's got, gotta change it. I gotta change it right now, or, you know, I gotta change it right now. So, something, you're gonna have to change something right now, okay? It's gonna happen very suddenly, very fast, because we have the Eight of Wands here. Th something is, is happening, it's gonna happen very, very fast. Something isn't working out, this is a dead end. It is a dead end. It's time for a change. The time is now. That's what we were talking about. We were talking about eights, which are abundance. Okay. You, you have abundance here, but two of them are reversed. You have to move forward to have that abundance. This is move forward. You have to, you have to take action. This is move in a new direction to, and to have abundance. 888 is abundance. Okay. The time is now, but you have to you have to be ready for it, right? And you have to make those moves. And I feel like you haven't you've, maybe you've been in a place where you haven't had the confidence. I mean, the Six of Wands reverse is a lack of confidence, no willpower. You know, fighting a losing battle. You just 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 giving in to the circumstances that you are in when you probably need to. Uh, make a better choice, make another choice, break free from this mentality that you have to stay in this situation. You don't have to stay. You're, you're not tied to that situation. Well, you, you, you think you're tied to it, but you're not. I mean, with the Eight of Swords reversed, you can escape from this situation. You can. That's your own mentality. I got to stay in this situation. You don't got to stay in that situation. If it's not working out and you're not getting any payout, you know, and it's a dead end and there, it's no life to live. I feel like I feel like you need to completely walk away. Maybe you need to admit defeat that this is a losing battle. And you know that's ego. The 5 of swords is a card of ego. It really is. It's like I don't want to admit my defeat because then that shows my weakness. It's better to admit your defeat and head towards abundance than to stay trapped in this situation where this is no life and you're not winning, you're losing and it is a constant battle. So I feel like you need to uh, master your emotions. Seriously, we've got the King Cups. Follow your heart in a new direction. Um, listen to your intuition. Maybe you need to focus on love because the King of Cups is about love and the Lover's card is too. Anyhow, let's keep going. Death reverse. Holding on is getting old. That's in the future can't do this anymore it's it, it's dead it, this is this is I, I don't know if you're in some sort of hostile situation as well with the with the five of swords reversed it feels like you're in a situation where it's a constant fucking battle sorry maybe you want to leave it feels like you do it feels like you want to leave but there's that mentality it's like i can't i can't get past that maybe it's fear it could be with the six of wands reversed right next to the eight of swords reversed fear that you know it's not going to work out if i do leave you know fear of change because death is change seven of pentacles reversed something definitely not working out 
something you invested in is not growing. There's no growth there. It's, it's dead. This is a dead end. That's your dead tree that I talk about all the time. It's like you put in a lot of effort and a lot of work into something. It's like, and you're getting nothing out of it, you know? But it's because, I don't know who you're dealing with. Maybe you're, deal you're obviously dealing with somebody that is undependable and insincere. Maybe you don't see it. We have a blindfold here. Knight of Swords. Princess of Wands. Tower reversed. And the Knight of Cups. Okay. So the Tower reversed. Trying to avoid something. But you can't avoid it. Maybe you're trying to avoid change. Avoiding upheaval. Avoiding chaos. But I feel like some this unexpected opportunity for love. <laughs> oh my God. Knight of Swords. Princess of Wands in the future. Page of Wands. That's an offer or an invite that is exciting. Somebody may have burst into your world. They've, this is a perfect match. It is. It's a new suitor. Somebody may be bursting into your world. They, you know, Maybe they're coming to the rescue or they've come to the rescue. I mean, the Knight of Swords is a knight in shining armor. This is a rescuer. Maybe you need to take a risk. You need to... Uh, Make a move. Somebody is making a move. It's time to make a move. It's time to, this could be a sudden departure, a sudden arrival. Somebody has suddenly arrived. Maybe you didn't expect it. There's definitely unexpected here with the lovers in tower. Somebody could be, or they have, because it's in the present. Maybe somebody has rushed into your life. They've come out of nowhere. Maybe you've been trying to avoid it. Or, you know, this is avoidance. Trying to avoid change. <laughs> this is what we got here. That is exactly what we have here. Death reverse next to the tower reverse. No, I'm too scared. I feel as though uh, you have an exciting new direction ahead with the Page of Wands. Okay, there's an opportunity for you to go in a new direction. But you're going to have to deal with some sort of loss. And I know that there's going to be a loss because the death card wouldn't be here and the tower wouldn't be here okay so maybe a lot of the, everybody's the readers are gonna say oh you can, that's avoiding it but you're trying to avoid it but you can't avoid it you you can avoid it up until now it's avoiding it up until now okay things are falling apart okay the tower is falling apart it's a extreme okay it's a it's a permanent loss of some sort of a foundation so I feel like you you've been in a false sense of security trying to avoid you know releasing it because of probably fear or victim mentality or you know maybe it's because it's been safe but I feel like I feel like things are gonna change whether you like it or not you may be feeling some sort of internal disruptions I feel like you're going to be extremely shocked Maybe you're shocked right now. I do feel like we have a shock factor here. Somebody could be rushing or I feel like they already have because the Knight of Swords is in the present. It's like this is an arrival. Okay, it's an arrival. You know, um, coming out of nowhere. But I feel like, I feel like, and I feel like you're unprepared. I feel like you're unprepared for a sudden change. I feel like there's, there's somebody, uh, is, is, this is like a savior of some sort coming to save the day. Somebody is coming in, and, and, I, and, and I don't know if it comes from a job, if this person, something about work, if you, there's something to do with work. I don't know if you met this person through a job. Or if you're going to meet this person through a job. Because we have work here a couple times. But we also have something not working out. Something's not growing. It's, it's, it's really dissatisfied. You, I feel like you're really dissatisfied with your current circumstances. There's, this is not what you asked for, right? There's, there's, this is not a win to you. You're not winning. This is losing. It's losing. It's losing a battle. 
but I feel like, I mean, in the future, you have the Knight of Cups, which is love. It's an offer of love. It's a new relationship, which I can see that you have an opportunity for with the lovers and at the right place, new sexual partner, the Page of page of Wands. This is an exciting opportunity. You know, I feel like you, you have an opportunity for new love here. Um, this is this is somebody that you have a lot in common with that is that that I feel like this person has just rushed right into your life and they have burst into your life but I feel like there's some sort of fear that is holding you back fear of change or fear of uprooting you know there could have something to do with uprooting I feel like uh, Everything happens for a reason. That Eight of Pentacles in reverse right in the middle. Something isn't working out. Somebody's not, not putting in effort. They're choosing to stay in a situation because it's safe. But there's going to be an unexpected change. It feels like you're going to be forced or you're being forced by the universe to leave that situation. Because you have another opportunity here that is more in alignment with yourself. I feel like you're, you're, I don't know if it's like suddenly in love either. I mean, that, that could certainly be the case. You could, because the tower is extremely fast. Extre and I see fast. I see communicating with somebody. I see increased communication. I see falling in love. Something is going on here. So I don't know if you're falling in love with somebody with that Knight of Cups. This is somebody that is a lover, okay? Looking for a relationship. Expressing feelings. I do believe that you are going to be shocked or you very soon. That's in the future. So that hasn't happened yet. That tower in reverse. That's that's an extreme. You can't avoid it. You're not going to. You can't avoid it. You can't avoid this change. And I feel like you've been trying to. You could get in a fight. With somebody, uh, the Five of Swords and the uh, Tower Boat, that could be extreme, extreme. And and then the Six of Wands, that's losing a battle. I feel like you could definitely end up getting in a fight with somebody that um, causes a departure. Death reverse, holding on is getting old. It's time to go. It's time to go. It is. I mean, I can't. It is. It's time to go in that new direction. It's like there's an opportunity here that is very well suited for you. I mean, that's that whole lineup in the future. I mean, that's a, it's very, but you're going to have to, sorry, you're going to have to, it's like change your foundation. It's like, because the next card is a tower, which is a foundation. It's a false sense of security that you've been holding on to. Maybe you've been protecting yourself. There's fear, fear of, of uprooting or fear of not being accepted or fear of starting over. I also feel like we have somebody here who has low self-confidence. Because they have been belittled, you know, they have been belittled. They have been made to believe that they're not good enough. So anyway, Aries, I feel like you have an unexpected choice in love that is right around the corner. You may be going right towards very, it's extremely sudden. It is extremely sudden with the, with the Knight of Swords and the Tower. And then we have the Knight of Cups that is, that is like an expect, unexpected choice in love following the heart in a new direction. And there is new direction with the Princess of Swords, the Page, I mean, the page of Wands. That's a new direction. It's exciting. A new adventure. Starting a new adventure. You're going to be starting a new adventure with somebody that is very, very well suited for you. But before you start that new adventure, you're going to be removing an obstacle. An obstacle is going to be removed. This obstacle has been holding you back. It's been holding you back from your new life.
death reverse and the page of wands that's your new life you've been held back by something could be other people could be it could be ego okay it, it could be ego ego could be what's holding you back you know um could also be fear I feel like you could be choosing to walk away from somebody, um, choosing, you know, I just want to be happy. I just want to be happy. I want more passion. I want more excitement in my life. You may be choosing to walk away from somebody that has, uh, been keeping you trapped or something like that. unavoidable change this is unavoidable it is if you resist it you're gonna lose money there's like the eight of pentacles reverse the seven of pentacles reverse that's losing investments losing money i mean i'm just being honest with you you have to walk away you have to break free from this Whatever it is that you are trapped in, you are trapped in, and maybe it's your mind. Maybe that you're you're protecting yourself for, from from something. Falling in love, whatever it is, the, the end the end result is the Knight of Cups. That's a relationship. It's love. It's it's falling in love, expressing feelings with the Lovers card. You're gonna you're gonna. I don't know if you're deepening a bond with somebody very fast extremely suddenly but i do see a financial pinch here absolutely i do you need to go in another direction you do you do you do you do you do some of you could be losing a job i mean i hate to say that but with the eight of pentacles reverse and the seven of pentacles reverse it's, it's losing or not seeing a payout for something that you invested it it's not getting what you thought you were gonna get and it's and it's because you have to there's somebody that you need to walk away from with that five of swords, you know? I can't make it up. Think about that soul journey. There's the, in the records of what we talked about. It's time for you to go in a new direction. And I feel like you're going to be presented with the opportunity. I think you already have. Because the minute I said that, I looked at the missed opportunity card. I think you've already... you've you've. It feels like you've missed an opportunity. It feels like you have. Obviously, it's still here. You're going to be given the opportunity to go in a new direction. I suggest that you build that new foundation. With, with whoever this unexpected choice is. It's an offer of love, okay? You got an offer of love here. It's, it, it's, it's, it's a perfect match. But I think this is also a painful choice. I do feel like it's a painful choice because you're probably gonna have to leave something else behind it is a choice between two do you want to live a life where you're fighting a constant battle and there's no growth and there's no payout or do you want something more that's the choice good luck